Everybody plays the fool sometimes. There's no exception to the rule. Listen, baby. Maybe factual, it may be cruel. I ain't lying. Everybody plays a fool. Boop, boop, boop. Boop, 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 boop. Listen. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, family. Welcome, welcome, welcome to the Dango Mental House. As y'all begin to filter this a little bit more, as you can see, ain't nothing normal about this place we living in right now, right about now. So if there ain't no beauty, you got to make some beauty. Have mercy. Listen to me, y'all. If this ain't one of the most craziest things I've heard, wait, listen. Don't let me. Don't let me go. Let let the news tell you. Talk about this incident and put pressure on the restaurant. The former employee is defending herself. She claims there is more to this story. She's aiming. She's leaning. She's not just going up in the air trying to scare people. She's trying. To well, this morning, attorney. Pointed right at me. I don't know how she didn't get me. And this afternoon, I paid, I paid my fees. I did what I had to do. What else do you want from me? I can't give you nothing but an apology if you want that. But I need the same thing. We both need to apologize to each other. All right, what's up with you two? I'm back again with another video. So listen, man, today I got a story about a situation. Oh, my goodness. Hold on, Carlos. This story is coming from my brother. <laughs> Mr. Carlos, my brother, y'all go on over to his channel and check him out. Um, the young man uh, does a very good job. And uh, this, this article is coming from his page. The girl, an uh, employee, tried to kill somebody shooting out the window. Shooting out the window, shooting out the window. Oh, Lord. At another human being because some fries was missing or some craziness, insanity, it it makes no sense. It makes no sense. And God, I can't believe we have deteriorated this low. I can't believe it. I cannot believe we have just... It's like, who do this sound normal? Family from Florida filed the lawsuit Everybody after the up. guilty plea claiming Jack in the Box was negligent for not keeping customers safe from potentially dangerous employees. In its original answer, Jack in the Box denied all allegations, writing they had no control over yeah, or yeah. legal responsibility for a third party like Ford. Mm, third party. Yeah. And look how they treat shot at <laughs> you miss up a third argument point. about curly fries. That's the allegation in a lawsuit filed against Jack in the Box and an employee. The shooting happened in 2021. With the attorney for the family who was just that just released the shocking video. ABC oh, Thursday's Jessica Willie is live at the restaurant where it all happened, Jessica. Eric, attorney Randall Callanan has scheduled a news conference for tomorrow morning here at the Jack in the Box near Bush Airport. He tells me he recently got this video through a discovery request. The employee has already served her sentence, but in a lawsuit filed by that family from Florida, they say they want to still hold the restaurant accountable. The order a number two with curly fries after a mother and her six-year-old daughter landed in Houston. The father picked them up, placed the order at this jack-in-the-box on JFK Boulevard near Bush Airport. Fifteen minutes later, they were speeding out of the drive through trying to avoid fire. In just-released video, employee Alania Ford seems agitated with customer Anthony Ramos. He is in the driver's seat, according to a lawsuit. His pregnant wife is in the passenger seat, and their six-year-old daughter is in the back. They paid twelve ninety nine for a combo, the lawsuit says, but didn't get the curly fries they ordered. Not even halfway into the dispute, the video shows Ford ready a 
Minutes later, and with another employee, she throws ice and condiments through the window before firing at least twice at the family. Ford was initially charged with aggravated assault with a weapon, but pleaded guilty to a lesser charge. The conduct got one year deferred adjudication and completed it, court records show, in June. The family from Florida filed the lawsuit after the guilty plea, claiming Jack in the Box was negligent for not keeping customers safe from potentially dangerous employees. In its original answer, Jack in the Box denied all allegations, writing they had no control over or legal responsibility for a third party like Ford. Her plea also prohibits her from possessing a firearm in the future. The family and their attorney returning to the crime scene for a news conference tomorrow morning. Jeez, Jessica Willie, ABC 13, Eyewitness News. Okay. Okay, you know, oh my God, I don't even know where to start with something so damn crazy. You see, um, some people, and I mean this, though it doesn't matter what color they are at all. Like, the fact of the matter is some people are so dysfunctional that they think it's okay to shoot somebody for no freaking reason. For something that you put on the scale of the universe, you can't even do it, no measure, nothing. And they so damn crazy, they justify this type of damn behavior. And that's, she don't think she did nothing wrong. She said, I done did my time. I done went to jail. What, what? You crazy girl. You have no value of human life at all. You have no more value for life than you have for them damn fries that you cook it back there. And so that's a matter of the heart. See, that's that's a matter of um, just totally void of what makes you human. You void of that right now. So you got to be off the streets and they suing you. Um, I, I, You should be having extensive therapy instead of just trying to find, find you a whole lot of uh, money that you don't have. You already poor and crazy and nobody probably took the time to um, really make sure that your mentals was on point. Because anybody who mental is on point, honey, ain't going to shoot at nobody out the damn jack-in-a-box drive through window for nothing. For some damn curly fries. Bitch, it's... Oh, oh God. Let me go. Let me go. Please let me know what y'all think down in the comments below. Please, I can't take it. Um, this This is too sick. I'll see you in the next video. I want to hear what you what you think. Leave a comment and I'll see you in the